I know I just made a Bitcoin video yesterday, but as y'all can see, it has took that option that I already had played out. It was it literally faked us. It came and hit the 50 MA and then shot straight down. Played us so hard. As y'all can see, this was the first option that I had coming up here. The three attempts to the high. This is what I originally thought. Because it was either they were going to recover their whole candlestick or half the candlestick. And they decided to recover half the candlestick and reverse the markets and hit these EMAs. But on the four hour, let me take this off for y'all. On the four hour, y'all can see this candlestick. Look at that wick. That is crazy. It already started dropping and faked everybody. It shot right back up, hit that 50 EMA and shot right back down. And you see this is what I was talking about. This is how they're gonna try to catch you off guard. So at this point in time right now, we may come hit this 50 M, excuse me, the 20 MA one more time and then we'll completely just fall off the table. That's what I'm looking looking at right now because I don't think this thing's going any higher since I already had these previous options. As y'all can see, first option had the candlestick, boom, reverse, and we can clearly see it's literally right there. Y'all can check my previous videos out. This is the exact same chart that I already had. And y'all can see that it is playing out. That's what I'm trying to teach y'all and get y'all to understand. The only option, you can literally read these charts. Let me take this off. Like you see where this, this peak is at, right? Where I had it. See the way it goes up right here and up right here? This is the peak, literally. Boom. We just can't see it. But once you learn how to read the charts, you'll be able to see all the wicks. And it'll, it'll kind of like fill in itself. If you get what I'm saying, you know, when you get used to doing something like you got a job, you just do it over and over and over again. You start to see things you originally couldn't see. But anyways, that's a four hourly chart. And like I said, we're on our way down. Show y'all on the daily. On the daily, as y'all can see, let me take this drawings off. And look right there. The 20 MA is about basically tapped at 20 MA on the daily. So, you know, this thing is just going down. It's going down. We're not getting that move up because we recover half the candlestick. Now let's look on top of that wick. Look at top of that wick right there. That is literally half of this candlestick. It is perfect. You know, like they like you can read these charts. So let me go a little farther out. Go out to this weekly. All right. So boom. Our next support level is right here around nineteen thousand. But I'm gonna say more around like nineteen thousand five hundred. It's gonna be a start of a extreme candlestick that you probably don't want to be a part of because this is the 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 big drop that i've been saying for the while for a while now basically but anyways i mean we're sitting at twenty thousand now i mean we're going down at least you know what i'm saying we're going ten thousand dollars i mean point blank period you know what i'm saying no if ands or buts that's our next actual support level is ten thousand dollars we might slow down around fourteen thousand a little bit but Overall, it's going to still be dropping. You know, they might fake us out, like I said before, around this area. But our real support level is ten thousand dollars. Will be a completion of this head and shoulders right here. So we're looking at about a drop in the next week or two. You know what I'm saying? We talking about a whole another fifty to seventy five percent of the market will be gone. So yeah. So anyways, I had had these lines set up. So once I hit this 19,000 line, we, we're definitely going to have a crazy candlestick. And it'll be on the daily candlestick. It's not even going to be on this weekly, but it's going to be at least halfway down here to the 14,000. And then we're going to go to the 10,000. Now, the thing is, when we get to 10,000, though, like I told y'all before, I believe we will get a bounce up that, back up to 14,000. And then a rejection all the way down to $5,500 to recover all the you know what I'm saying all the candlesticks that's what they're doing and that's what they previously did before the exact same thing like look at it this is the head and shoulders shoulders the flip of the the EMA as you can see it was on top of the 20 EMA right here right and now it's on the bottom of it got rejected and continued down hit that last fake up and this is the last fake up right here we are literally right, look, right here this is where we at right here this is the exact same thing the algorithm has set up. This is doing the exact same thing. You have to watch my videos because you will understand that this is not a coincidence. So it's literally going to do the exact same thing. As you can see, it took three weeks to co completely recover every candlestick there was. And we're in it three weeks. By the end of September, it'll be a completely, complete reverse market. Like, like I really do believe within the next month, it's going already going to hit down to five thousand dollars 
Because once we get down to ten thousand dollars, like I said, we could get this bounce. But at any point in time, they can literally just mash the market all the way down and recover everything. And it's gonna be just like this. You see this wick right here, right? This wick actually went all the way down to three thousand something dollars. And look where it started at eight thousand. So you know what I'm saying? That's what about the same percent drop, you know what I'm saying? About a 66% drop. And that's that's what we're looking at basically right here. So at any point in time, like I said, it's going to be a flash crash. It's going to be a large wick just like this. It's going to be this whole zone, literally. From $10,000 to $5,000 will be a, a wick. Because they will close above this. And I got to show you the monthly chart so you understand that also. There's a clear pattern right here. Use the M to the dub. Boom, come up retracement. When it retraces, it cannot go, well, I'm gonna say it cannot close on a monthly under $10,000. That's how I know once it gets down here, it literally has to shoot straight back up into safety, all the way back to $20,000. So whenever it do hit $5,000, it can go all the way back up that $20,000, like instantaneously type thing. And then we'll get a bounce off to 14,000. Once we bounce off 14,000, that is a confirmation of a full reversal of the market. But obviously, if you're already in the trading and you see this thing come down here, which it will, and you know all the other coins going to be even worse. But that just means everything is that cheap. This just means you would have a possibility of changing your whole lifestyle because you know that this is coming. Don't be like these people commenting and getting all mad that I'm telling y'all the truth about the markets. I could hype y'all up and lie to y'all, but that would be wrong. And that's not what I'm here for. I'm here to try to teach you and to read these markets. So when this thing does happen, you can capitalize on it. Everyone has a chance. And if you're watching my content, you definitely have a chance. And you should be saving up your money and just rubbing your hands together and just picking what coin you want to hop in. And get rich off of. That's just all I'm saying. Because you watch my content. And this thing coming down to $5,000. And you don't get in anywhere. That's on you. Because this is the easiest money. You can ever possibly make. In your life. Because I remember when I first started learning how to trade. This was happening right here. Obviously we're recovering everything. Because it's a large hidden shoulders. But this is what's happening. I watched the markets do this. I watched what I could have, what I could have had. That what got me so far and so deep in the trading because of this right here. I witnessed this. I even jumped in a few things, you know what I mean? It wasn't a five, six, seven hundred percent type thing in a day. Now, once that happens, I mean, you know what I mean? You're going to be like, let me learn. Let me learn. Now I learn. And now something like this, I'm never going to miss out of. I'm not going to miss out on this next time. And I hopefully my people, you can subscribe to me and all and watch my content. I hope you don't miss out neither because it's coming. Don't get mad that I'm telling you the truth. Get glad that I'm telling you the truth and capitalize off of it. Because it's going to be just like this. Look at that. You see that wick? The wick is larger than the body of the whole candlestick. Just think about that. It's going to be the same thing. You need to get in. Anyone that got in right here, you know what I'm saying? The monthly chart, you know what I'm saying? Everybody's sitting pretty. Y'all could be sitting pretty too, man. I'm giving y'all well. I gave y'all more enough warning. You know what I mean? And I, this was the only little capitalization you could have took, and that's what I told y'all before. The only time we coming through because we're we're flipping below. Like as y'all can see, like I showed y'all before in the weekly, we always stayed above the 100 EMA. Y'all can see on the chart that's from 2019. That's enough. Y'all can see. Boom. Now we finally below the 100 EMA. So we had to come up. And get rejected. We didn't come back to the 100 EMA, but you know what I mean? Came up to the 20. Close enough. Reversal. But yeah. Anyways, anything I just said is not financial advice at all. Y'all grown. You make your own decisions, but like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.